Uh, while you guys are voting, we have a very special treat for you. Uh, a good friend of ours is uh, actually, uh, 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 we're actually recording something because some people want to see him perform. And uh, yeah, so some, some people have taken a shine to him and they want to get a professional recording, so we are going to do that. Uh, he's an absolutely amazing performer. He's going to come up, he's going to entertain you guys. Uh, give it up, and remember we're being recording, so give it up live. Have a blast, have fun because it's goddamn amazing. Give it up for the wonderful Dan Duarte! I feel bad for you, son. I got a 99. Camry was a hit from my mom. <laughs> Please hit me. <laughs> got an untrick motorist. I'm totally covered. You guys fucking take that shit out. It's got a moonroof. That's pretty sweet. Ladies love moonroofs. Almost as much as they like 99 Camrys. Shouldn't, I call, shouldn't they call it like a hearse direct to me? Is it just me that think that? That's... <laughs> Um, should have wrote some jokes, Jesus. It's way more fun to make fun of someone else's shitty jokes, that's for sure. <laughs> Think about starting my own Seahawks themed Vietnamese noodle restaurant called Pho Umble. <laughs> <laughs> starting a summer school for pregnant teens called Third Trimester. <laughs> I'm gonna start my own female-only workout facility for women with vitamin Z deficiency called SCURVES. <laughs> I don't even have that joke. <laughs> I haven't played in so long, my fingers hurt when I touch the strings. It feels like knives touching me. It's like playing on knives. Um, is anyone know the lyrics to um, Song About Rainbow? Is it that Kermit the Frog song? I don't know the lyrics, that's not how to play it. You guys want to play it? I wanted to do it as Jason Statham. Why are there so many? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. We should all do it as Jason Statham. <laughs> now, I don't know how to do Jason Statham, but I think I can teach you guys how to do it. I think he, he's got a few key phrases. <clears throat> like, imagine you just hucked a bunch of oven cleaner. <laughs> your, your jeans are too tight, your balls are all pinched up, like, up inside your butt crack. I think, I'm guessing. <laughs> And you've just done like a thousand pull-ups and you don't drink any water. Yeah, like that. Oi. So, repeat after me. Oh, I need a band-aid. Oh. Oh, uh, I need a band-aid. <laughs> where's the safe? Yeah, try yeah, try that one. Where's the safe? Where's the safe? Yeah, where's the safe? That's pretty good. <laughs> Sorry, this is not even a joke. I'm just fucking mad <laughs> Oh, there's so many songs about you. Ugh, no, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> oh, man. I, I don't have a license right now, but I drove here, so if you guys don't tell the cops that, it's cool. There's no cops here, right? <laughs> Is it okay if, like, I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm a little racist, but it's only against cops. Is that cool? Like, is that, because they're like a shitty, like a shitty uh, breed, right? That is. Motorcycle cops generally, that's who gives me the tickets in school zones, is motorcycle cops. I'm stopping four children and I got a school zone ticket. you think that would get you out of the ticket by stopping for children, but I guess I got quotas. Not me, I don't got joke quotas, guys. I just fucking rip it up. I was, uh, I was falling behind a, uh, a suburban today and it had all the stick figures in the back. And I'm not sure exactly why people put those in the cars, but guessing by the size of this lady, this is all the people she ate. <laughs> <laughs> Starting with Dr. Dad and ending with a cat, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> weirdo. You guys like, you guys like pranks? You know, a real fun prank is just to go to like a Walmart where you see a lot of these stick figures on the backs of cars and just take like a red tube of lipstick and start crossing off children. <laughs> or the cat, just for fun. <laughs> Get in the face. It's the name of that cat, get in the face. 
I, uh, I got a DUI and I finally am getting my, trying to get my license back and, um, have you guys got, ever got a DUI? You ever got a, yeah, woo! Do we? Do 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 we? I know it's not a, I mean, it's like a really shitty way to end a third date. In the back of a squad car, sitting on your hands, eating the boner pills that you had in your pocket. You're like, I'm gonna have a fucking good, oh no, I'm not, I'm gonna have a bad night. Eating the boner pills. Never to find these boner pills, copper. Fuck. Fuck. Tuck it up in the belt. All night. And if you ever get a DUI, and like I drove a long time without getting a DUI. Like I've been carried by the cops into my car, or into my apartment like a newlywed. And I didn't get a DUI somehow. Well, I know why, because I went to Iraq with one of the police captains, but that's, I mean, that's, I, that's not lucky, I went to Iraq, that's totally shitty, so. Back in 2004, back when it was cool, it's like, it's not a big deal. You know? Back when people still bought you drinks and shit. And... Yeah, you're welcome, thanks man. I wish, uh... That wasn't the point, though. Uh, that's okay. No, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. That's what my mom says. She should have me. So my mom called me a bad investment once when I was a kid. Which is probably why you don't make investments out of wedlock, I'm guessing. I don't know. But that's, I'm going to prove her wrong one of these days. My sister's a doctor, so I guess like she's kind of right on like the, who's winning, I guess, if there's a winning of that scenario. Uh, my sister like, well, my like, sister likes to do things, like, she told me I had OCD, which is cool, if she wasn't a doctor, like, now I have OCD, like, before if someone just told me I had OCD, I would be like, oh, fuck you, I'm not gonna believe you, which is a doctor, that's like her, you can't just tell people you have shit, and just like, and then she got off the phone, like, it was, like, she didn't tell me what to do with that. <laughs> Am I like the fucking scab picking OCD? Like, what do I have? Or am I just like the rug tassel OCD? I'm, or am I just like, I wipe, I wipe till it bleeds OCD? Like, what is the OCD? Which, what am I? But I tried looking it up, but then I also have ADD, so I didn't finish the whole article. <laughs> I have a new joke. Anyways, so the girl on the DUI uh, mission didn't call me back, so I wrote a song about her. It's called uh, You Whistled Your Way. Seriously, I'm not gonna stop until you guys stop. <laughs> Lips are gonna have to meet it all out, staring at the bus runs out. Got my corners up one more time. Your lips are gonna crack and bleed, and I will have to stare at me as the bus runs out. The corners of your mouth. Thanks a lot, you guys. It's been great. I'm Andrew Warte. See you in LA. now. <laughs> um, we have a winner. 